All right, what's going on, guys? Jeff here, back again with another video. So, um, I just saw something. I literally want to record this right now because I think this is very, very interesting for us to really look at. So, over here, you can look at the 10 year treasury note, uh, which is the yield. The yield is going up. Uh, I haven't really been looking at the yield for the past few days, and suddenly I see this sudden spike in yield. Very, very suspicious because the things that um, how yield basically work is that. When the yield goes up, it simply means that the people who are invested in bonds are going down, um, which is inversely the same. If the yield is going down, it means that the people who are getting into bonds are getting more. Kind of like simple math. So right now, if we suddenly see the yield curve going up to this kind of um, this kind of trajectory, a huge percentage is that people are actually getting out of the bonds market. And usually when people get, get out of the bonds market, uh, we usually treat it for three different reasons or well, four different reasons, basically. Uh, the first one would be to put it into the stocks market. The second one will be to the commodities market. The third would be for crypto. And the fourth will be basically to just put it into the bank, simply just save hodl cash. Uh, but I think for the fourth, um, possibility isn't really that high simply because if you're going to just put it in the bank, you might as well just keep it in the treasury yield. You're going to get higher rates anyway. There's no reason for you to do so. Um, of course, there's also another one which is basically just taking out the cash because they need it. Uh, but I feel that's very, very unlikely for us, especially when we see such a huge increase in the yield. I don't think it's just because of people suddenly needing cash. Kind of weird. Uh, but... Just to give you guys context, uh, if we were to put it at a 10-day uh, curve, basically, you can kind of see how it goes. 1.3, 1.4, 1.4, 1.4. And then it's kind of just like sideways trading all this while, okay? And then suddenly, this spike up. This spike is something is very, very strange for me. I feel that there's a very, very good chance that we might actually be starting to see somewhat of a bull run. Uh, I feel that there is a good possibility that people might actually want to take out cash from the bonds market and just plow everything into the stocks market, uh, commodities, crypto, like what I said before. Uh, I think crypto will be very, very unlikely simply because uh, people who are actually in the bonds market probably wouldn't be in crypto and vice versa. People who are in the crypto market probably wouldn't um, want a 1.5% uh, return on their um, profits either. People in crypto want 1,700%, 17,000%. We do not want 1.5%. Uh, but yeah, um, I think that the, the high chance that we actually see a bullish indicator for the stocks market is very, very high. Uh, I feel that this would be a very, very important thing for us to look at, especially for the next few days to few weeks. Uh, this might be a very, very good indicator for us to really look at the market. Uh, but yeah, I'm very, very excited for this. Uh, but anyway, uh, just a short video. Uh, I actually just finished recording a video that I'm going to be uploading, but I'm going to be uploading this first because this is very important. Anyway, hope you guys like this content. Do follow me on my Instagram right here. Uh, I'll be posting. Um, news every single trading day uh, on my Instagram um, after January. But anyway, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.